I can't pronounce my name. <laughs> that took a while for me to say fishy fishy. Okay. Ten. What nine. What do we have here? Eight. Seven. Eight players over two thousand. Brilliant season, the first game. Let's go. The King's Gambit, as usual. We've played this line a thousand and one times against brilliancies. He switches it up with this now. Okay. So the Fisher. Okay, no longer the Fisher. <laughs> if he goes knight c6, we're transposing back to a line we've played a million and one times. Okay, knight b4 it doesn't concern me because I can play bishop e2. Yes. Castles, and now back to a3. Uh, I mean, I play a3, and then bishop a2, uh, bishop d3. And this should be fine. He might play bishop g4, yes, all of this has been seen before. Now bishop f8, though. Ooh. Did I blunder bishop f8? Uh, I shouldn't have. C3 doesn't work. I have to play D5, I guess. Yeah, and if knight E5, I take. Okay, I will take with the... Uh, Pawn like so, or with the rook, well, let's take with the pawn, and knight e5, uh, knight d4 I mean, and tending knight f5, knight h5 might be a bit annoying, knight h5 and queen g5, might be a bit annoying, okay, knight h5 I'm going bishop g3, then queen e3, this bishop is quite passive. I have a good attack on the dark squares. Okay, I'm going to take like this. Now if knight h5, I'm thinking of just playing the bishop here. Yeah, no reason to allow queen g5. Okay, queen h4. I might just trade queens. Should be careful of this. Yeah, he's going to play it. Okay. How do I want to meet that? Maybe... Uh, maybe this, yes. Maybe a 4. A 4, a 5. 4, a 5, I wonder. Okay, no, I need to get my king safe first. So let's do this. Should be careful not to give up this B pawn. Though I do get rook B1, so it should be fine. Like if he can add pressure. I wonder if... Uh, Okay, I guess like queen h4 is an aggressive idea. Uh, king, king there. Hmm. Okay, f4. Come on, let's strike while the iron is hot. Although that does blunder the pawn, no? Hmm. Okay, this I can meet with rook, so this doesn't scare me. And now with queen f6. I play a5. All seems very flimsy. Oh, this is quite dangerous now. Um, I have to play queen e2. No other move, right? He might play f5 against that. Looking dicey. He's out playing me. Just so we're clear. Uh, maybe just bishop here. Does seem very scary though. Does seem very scary. Like he has the mate threat always. <sighs> hmm. How do I want to play? Okay. Okay, this is very helpful now. Yeah, trading queens I definitely don't mind. So let's let's do it like this, and then rook here. 
Now a five. Now I should play a five. It should be somehow very helpful for me. How do I exploit this though? Let's just come in with the king. Hmm. Maybe. Okay, check. I don't know. How do I exploit this? Okay, let's. Yeah, sorry I'm not talking, but I have to try to win. Maybe he'll fall for d5. He does not. Okay, that was very close. That was very close. Yeah, sorry I wasn't talking there, but that was a very close call. Why is Joe? Okay, Joe is playing now. Well, man, what's going on? Bailoof, he won his game. Nice. He's playing. 1400 Mr. Halim Mansour He's not He's online but not playing Oh he lost against Bailouf Okay Facundo Quiroga Let's see what we have here Facundo Quiroga The Smith Mora is what we get Hopefully I can come back to 2400 <laughs> With this tournament so the e6 setup against the Mora accepted, okay. Oh, this, this I meet with queen d4, attacking this and this. Uh, I take with the pawn to be able to play bishop a3. Oh, he gives me that. Um, I should take, I believe, just re return my pawn. Yeah, I don't see anything better. I didn't have to, okay, yeah, probably I had to take though. Um, yeah, so bishop d3 or e5. Probably e5. No, e5 weakens, I don't want to weaken. Let's go bishop d3. I don't want to weaken these squares, give his knights uh, breathing room, right? So. Wow, that's <laughs> crazy. Check his mate. Okay, lagging for some reason. Okay, this is mate. Yeah, I was of course considering Rook takes a6 fate, but yeah, it wasn't good, I think. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. As as Mora players, we have to consider Rook takes a6. <laughs> it's, just, it's just in our nature. In our soul. So nice, two, two pretty nice games there. Lost to a 1500, he must have disconnected. What the? 
What was this, 1500? Twenty one hundred bullet. Okay. Brilliant is again and again I'm white. Okay, let's see if we can improve that line, the King's Gambit. We're still discussing the same line. Okay, here he offers a transposition, but he doesn't go for it. Transposition into the Fisher line. Okay. Hmm, this is maybe a bit premature. Let's castle, knight. Okay, I might, yeah. I might have allowed knight before there. Still haven't, still haven't found that uh, optimal setup in <laughs> this knight. Okay, so knight, g3, intending some knight of five ideas. Yeah, d5 would be a huge error because of g5, uh, e5. Yeah, seems good. Okay, he chooses to play knight h5. Okay, I take, play this, intending something like this, or knight h4. If bishop e7... I might reroute my knight. Okay, he wants to maybe. Uh, I don't know. Queen d7, maybe go to g4. Okay, I'll just play for this. I'll just play for this, yes. He prevents that. Very smart of him. Do I just increase my central control here? But that does allow knight c6 back, so. Let's be careful. Uh, maybe just double. I need to be careful because my uh, these pieces are kind of relying on each other in a sense. Uh huh. Okay, now d5 I think is good. It does give up e5, that's true, but I have the f5 square. Um, what's interesting also is a4, <laughs> a4 to go for Trixies. Let's play a4 and go for Trixies, huh? Oh, I gave him e5 in this way, okay, maybe it wasn't so optimal, but okay, still. Uh, I was, uh, I, I didn't, I wasn't aware he would come to, yeah, he would come to e5 so quickly, but okay, knight g4 I'm fine with, I play maybe rook f4. Okay, he wants to get rid of my knight, very fair. Uh, let's play this. Now against... So, yeah, against this, I just play this, I believe. Should be fine, as far as I see. I need to be careful. <sighs> Ouch! Ahem. 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 I wanted. I was the one who wanted to do this trick. Ouch! Yikes! Hello, and Samu. And he fell for it. <laughs> okay. Still, this position. What's it steal? Hello and Samo, thank you for watching my stream. Uh, maybe if I trade everything, the end game should be winning, right? Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, because all my pawns are on light squares, I have a good position in bind. He chooses not to take, obviously. Okay, but I can almost force this, because now if he goes queen d7, queen e6 would hit with a passed pawn, so... Oh, okay. Uh, he does have a lot of counterplay there, so... Let's do this. I guess. Ah, now that was clever. Now I have to... Okay, fine. 
I go here, take like this. I am down a pawn, but the end game is very much favorable for me. Let's try to. Okay, he's trying to go for these kinds of ideas here. Maybe king f5 he might play. Ouch, okay. Now he's succeeded in fixing my pawns. Mm. I don't see how he enters the position, so. Okay, he might fall into this trick. He doesn't. Very aggressive. How do I deal with this? I do not. Yeah, trackpad woes again. Ah, uh, trackpad. I should not. Why did I berserk Bailouf? Oh my god, seriously? I thought it read 1100. <laughs> yeah, every time I want to set up the mouse. Yeah, Bailouf. So, are you going to berserk back by waiting a minute? No, don't do that. Yeah, those were some funny Zuchtzwang's fate. Every time I have to pronounce German, I have to <laughs> concentrate for five seconds. And Samo, that's great. Great to see you in the tournament. Yeah, every time I want to set up my mouse. Not taking anything away from him, though. He played excellently there. Not trading the rooks. I missed that a4 was hanging. That was so stupid by me. Okay, he's going to play this line. Great. With f4. I am not familiar with this. This seems a bit counter uh, counter position. Uh, anti positional. I don't know, I must have studied it though. Yeah, okay, this is reasonable. This is reasonable, yeah. This is reasonable. This is quite fine. Mm, like in theory, this bishop is supposed to be a bit bad. Because of this pawn structure. But it's not like my light squared bishop is so great either. So let's try to go for this maneuver. He might start some mating attack. Uh, he doesn't. He's a very positional player. Maybe he'll go wrong and play c4. Please. Actually, it's a pawn I'm not sure I really want to take either. Do you know what? Okay, he plays c4 now. Uh, that's very smart. Something I've been missing was that he had the possibility of sacrificing there. He had the possibility of playing knight h7 there. Which would have been quite problematic. Not sure what I'm going for. I guess bishop h3 is my threat. Um, he prevents that, I guess. Now... Something like queen g3 should be good. He sacrifices for it, okay. It shouldn't, this shouldn't be sound, but... Eh, seems like it works for now. Okay, so... 
he does have to he can't take actually he could have taken there uh, that was quite stupid by me I don't know what I'm doing I'm getting scared that's what is happening he play bishop e3 and just generally annoy me or that don't know what this threatens doesn't threaten much actually um okay He's taking a while here. <laughs> oh my god. Sad. Okay. 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 That was way too close for comfort. <laughs> yeah. Nothing to say. That took the winds right out of me. Okay. <laughs> Oops. Uh, very tough. Chutso. 2372 he beat Joe in the first game as a 1500 professional player what are we getting ourselves into e4 okay the Mora I, you should have told me you're playing the Mora okay now we can play some real chess he seems to know this line somehow Bishop b7. If he responds with e5, I'm going to be impressed. Color me impressed. Okay, I think if he responds with queen e2, he doesn't know the theory. e5. Okay. We have a booked up player on our hands. And it's new theory. It's new theory. a4. Okay. Don't I have queen c7 here? Then he plays bishop d3, right? Yeah. He'll definitely play that, see? Now I play a5. And... I can't seem to remember. Is it... This should... Not sure. I don't remember this line. It's not like this, it doesn't go like this. Okay, but he has tremendous pressure now. He does have tremendous pressure. Um, if I play bishop e7... Shoot, I need to... <coughs> that was a sneeze there. Okay, don't worry guys. I'm not infected. <laughs> or presumably. Because you don't show symptoms usually. Anyway, so this should this should be more of a pawn up than a compensation position, if we can use that term. So let's see. Um, Twelve points, thirty minutes left. It might be possible to catch up. But losing these two games, both were really uh, close, so, yeah. Uh, losing these two, oh my god, what the, <laughs> why can I not take? 
I'm scared, but I mean if... Oh, shoot. I missed bishop b6. I'm lost. I have to give up the queen. Yeah, I missed this entirely. Oh, he has bishop e5. Oh, oh he has queen e5. Okay, three seconds there to take. Yeah. Seems strange. Of course he has yeah, rook here. Okay, speeds up now. Yeah, he should be able to do this. All right, so mystery player here completely destroyed me. Um, yeah, that line is fine for white. That's the basically the best line against the Moro, or at least the one the engines love to play. Uh, I I don't mean. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so this is a queen trap. If you play this Fort Knox variation of the French, um, uh, you need to know that your queen can get trapped, so you need to insert h6. Yeah, I played, uh, he played a good game. I uh, let's be clear when I said. Uh, when I said engine split, I don't mean he's an engine, of course. Just uh, saying that's the line that... Um, yeah, okay, here... Had I known he was pre-moving, okay. <laughs> I would have went for something else, but this does the job as well. Seven points. Seven, seven points. That's quite good. JK, that's not very good. Okay, Mr. Halim Mansour. This is a line we've discussed a thousand times as well. Many Lebanese players in this... Uh, in this arena. He enjoys this position for whatever reason. He plays Rook C8 now. I go knight f5, he takes, I take. Some kind of theory, I guess. a3 now. King g2, we transpose back. And now b5, I go bishop a2. Knight a5 shouldn't be so great, because it allows some knight uh, d5. Okay. He loves playing this uh, the straight, you could say. And here I play this. And oh, I wanted to play rook c8, but that doesn't work. I'm aware now that doesn't work. Okay, so we have to do this and go into some sort of endgame. Not what I wanted. I wanted to play rook c1, I mean, but that doesn't work. Okay, he wants to take my light squared bishop. That's very intelligent. Um, yeah. Uh, he wants to take my dark squared bishop because then it would be kind of trash the end game. Yeah, that's correct. But uh, how about this? And um, if I can prevent rook c8, maybe I can play for these kinds of ideas. Okay, so I have to do this, maybe like rook d3, yeah, 
Yeah, a5, he wants to play a4, obviously. But still, I maintain um, the activity on f7 here. So when rook c3 comes, maybe he'll play queen d4 then. Then that starts getting scary. Okay, he chooses to go for counterplay this way. Okay, I play rook d4. I don't know how I can arrange... Uh, Guess he wants to play like maybe queen f4 or something, but this should be. Yeah, not sure. Queen d4 now. Okay, he sees the tactic definitely. Queen b7. Queen b7 is the tactic. Um. Can I have, can I do something to meet, to meet that, um, like he always has pressure, so, okay, if I have to accept a draw, that would be very sad, so, okay, but I have to do this, now if he, if he plays rook b8, he doesn't play rook b8, rook b8 would have been a mistake there, so I can play this. Now this uh, this shouldn't be a draw because I have activity like this, threatening some mates. So he has to be careful. Uh, he creates some escape square, I guess. Um, yeah, that's uh, that's good actually because now I have to play this. I guess I don't know. Then this is quite drawish if I have to play this drawish. Okay, he doesn't trade rooks. I don't know about that. Mm. Okay, so how do I improve my position? Maybe this to be able to play. Okay, now he's allowing the mate again, so this is strange, I guess. Unless he wants to go for bishop f4. Okay, this allows b6. b7. Yeah, now what he did was very strange. Okay, I just march with my king now. This should be quite winning. Quite easily winning, actually. Yeah, I play rook here. This is gone. Oh, I missed that. Okay. So he can hold on for a bit. Yeah, but I have an extra rook, basically. I'm not finding the way to win this. Okay, I found the way, I think. Hold on. Play this now. Yeah, I should have known he was going to go for that. Yeah, I should have played more quickly there. I I, I, I expected the classic bullet trick there. But, uh, yeah. Okay, okay. That was a pretty close call there. A very close call. Um, yeah, this line generally leads to slightly better endgames for white. Whether they're winning or not is an open question. Bailoof winning against Mr. Joe. Nice. He berserked him though. Okay, we got Mr. Joe. He berserked me, so I berserk him back. But, okay, that wasn't very wise because I'm on a trackpad. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can. He's playing something new.
Uh, let's see. I got some pressure here. I should be careful of these ideas. So let's. Okay, maybe I should have played rook here. Mm. Wow. Maybe he wants to sack. He does not want to sack. Um. Okay, hold on. He's attacking the spawn. I'm defending somehow. He's getting way too much activity. <laughs> I don't like this. That I did not see. Wow. Now that's what you call a tactic. Is there any way for me to defend? Whoa. Doesn't seem like it. Huh. Impressive. Mr. Joe as usual. Tactics on point. Um, I have to play this I guess. I don't know. Ouch. Ouch. Nice game by him. Very nice game. Yeah, I just... I'm amazed Queen E1, Knight C3 worked, but it did. Yeah, it doesn't seem like there was anything I could do. Winning that was very important, but we did not. Okay, I'm down rating as well. How much am I down? I started at 23.90 something, yeah, down a bit as well, just losing rating every tournament, I can never have a good tournament, I've had one on stream, I think it was the viewer arena number 3, number 5 was actually good too, I was up 2-0 though against the finisher, then I lost 3 games. Or uh, 2 games. Don't know. Yeah, something like that. Keeps going up and back again. Yeah, I don't know why. What's going on with OBS? Somebody tell me. Okay, maybe b5. So we have this. Radical, but I need counterplay. Because otherwise this past pawn is looking annoying. Okay. Don't think there's any move. Okay, maybe he'll play knight d6. You never know. <laughs> ah, he wants to go for c6. Do I really care about c6? Can just go here. And uh, I'm taking c2 maybe next. Okay, he might play the queen. What am I doing against the queen? He doesn't. Okay. Oh, he's going for the past pawn. Hold on. Yeah, but I attack c6, important. Okay, I no longer attack c6. Yikes! Ew! <laughs> okay, but I do get d6, okay. I'm hanging on by a thread here. Hanging on by a thread. The stream keeps disconnecting for some reason. I don't know what's wrong with my... Either it's my connection or... Something's up with my comp. Yeah, it looks like it's my connection, for whatever reason. Doesn't seem to be perfect. Okay, I was thinking maybe to take here first. Okay, or like this. Why not? I get what he's trying to do, but not entirely convinced.
Yeah, he's kind of going loco in the Shoko. <laughs> Doesn't Rook here trap the Queen? Am I missing something? Hopefully I'm not. He might have Knight f5, but then I play King f6. I want to say. King f6. Oh, that doesn't trap the Alright. Check doesn't seem to help him, I believe. Doesn't really help him, I mean. Now I can play b3 and finally get some protection for my pawn. And I don't have to worry about it so much. Maybe strictly unnecessary actually, but okay. Um, so, now how to proceed, a5, strike while the iron is hot, 5, queen here, yeah, okay, a4 I always meet with b4, which should be fine, What in the world? Okay. <laughs> what was that? Okay, I'm giving him a bit of counterplay, so I should stop that. I really should stop that. Um, yeah, so how do I meet knight e5? Maybe. Bishop d1. Oh my god, that's a stone cold blunder, that's a peace hang, <laughs> he didn't even take it, what in the world are we playing guys, we're supposed to be, Ah, <laughs> that was a stone cold peace hang, did anyone see that, <laughs> oh my god, like I have no words. Okay, now I have potential here. Potential to do what exactly? To play rook a3. Rook a3 would trap his queen, right? This I'm not blundering, probably. Probably. Rook a3 would trap his queen. That seems like a correct assertion. Okay, he defends. Um, I don't like the pressure he has, so let's go back to e2. Very slow, my conversion. Very, very slow. Very methodic. Yeah, very slow. If he's going to... If he's going to take this, be my guest. I mean, I don't even care about that. Because then his dark squares would be so critically weakened. I don't know about the wisdom of playing this though. Let's. Um, okay, this I guess seems to work. Yeah, I can play this. And then I have rook d1. Uh, rook d3, I mean. Rook d3 seems to work, right? I'm not missing anything. Because I'm playing so badly, I need to... <sighs> okay, this works. No, there's this. Ugh. Okay, still up a piece. That's, that's the good thing. And okay, he doesn't. He doesn't want to defend that. I mean, he wants to defend that. Um, yeah, now this looks more dangerous, so... Okay, if he's going to defend, I'm going to defend. <laughs> yeah, let's see how we can convert this. Ok, 
Okay, he doesn't have as much counterplay as he thinks he does. He's trying to go for mid though, obviously. Hmm, that's strange. Because now this only helps me. Okay, and we escaped that. Very close. 17 points. And Samo, Joe Asad, and Bailouf all ahead of me. Looks like. Yeah, he might play B4 now. Wait, actually, after Queen B3, am I winning? Oh, I can only take G2 then. Ouch, I could have won much more than that, but okay, this should still be fine, I pick up g2 and f2, and f4 I mean, so still quite good, I don't know why the stream keeps reconnecting though, it's annoying, should be careful of knight e4 though, yeah. Okay, I don't see what rook g1 does, I have d5 now as a threat, knight f3 also might be a possible move, okay he gets out of the fork, but still I'm going to dislodge the knight, it's far too aggressive here. Okay, it's still far too aggressive, so just h6, he'll go knight h3, I guess knight g6 to prevent knight f4. Um, he wants to play bishop e3, I got that. He does have quite some activity, I'll give him that. Yeah, let's okay or oh, let's play e5 first to threaten the knight he sees it of course okay castle now might be playing some bishop h5 so i need to be careful um this intending maybe knight f4 yeah, maybe knight f4 is good. Okay, so I need to win this in two minutes. Might be possible, because he's playing a bit slowly here. I need not move the spawn, because it would give him access points. Okay, now, now I do move the pawn. I don't care about the check. It's fine. Uh, I'm kind of threatening. Okay, this is a good move. He wants to play. 